I think my camera overheated. I was looking for things to add to my wish list. Um, and I wanted a way to bring coffee and tea into the car. They don't seal totally, so it's not like you can throw them in a bag. But you can totally hold them and drink your tea or coffee. So I got two of those. And I think they'll be most useful here. Here on the pink. On the pink bed spread, you can kind of see with Metal's tail. <laughs> I cannot show you my absolute favorite thing that I found today because it would spoil a surprise, but I'm really, 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 really excited about it. Um, so I'll just have to wait oh, for another time. These I... While I have certainly watched all of the Outlander um, sh shows the whole series, I actually have never read the books, which is kind of weird because I'm a major reader and um, it's strange that I wouldn't have read them yet. Um, so I found this grouping and thought, thought that should come home. It's good to have some books like that around... I use the library a ton, but sometimes books don't come in, or I finish up a book for my book club, or whatever, and it's good to just have something around. Okay, so this one is Christmas present related, but I think it's okay. It's for Elijah. I don't think that he's going to watch any of this or care. Um, he... I found this on the kitchen counter last night. They went to Goodwill on their way to bowling last night. Elijah and Galen did. Um, I'll finish picking off the tag later. Um, and this is an extremely Elijah mug. Um, Beerstein in this case. Um, he is looking into apartments, probably planning on moving out soon. So he's going to need housewares and things like that to fill up his his space. So I found these. I'm not thrilled. In my head, they kind of coordinate it a little bit better than they do in real life. In real life, they kind of coordinate a wee bit better than they do on the camera. <laughs> I'd really, really like it if it was just the one color, like just the green, and not split between the two. I think that's a little strange. Um, but it was, I think it was like a dollar a piece for the mugs. And it's, I have got, I got a set of six of them. Yeah, one ninety nine for two. So, like I said, a dollar a piece. I got a set of six of them. He's going to need things to serve, you know, people who come to visit. If, if he doesn't like them, if he doesn't end up using them, it's not a big loss. They're definitely small. Um, he works in big portions. <laughs> Um, so they're definitely, they would be small for him for like a big thing of tea or something like that. But, um, for a quick sip of water or something, they'd be just fine. Um, and like I said, he's going to need things for when other people visit. So I'm trying to start padding that out. That's just a wee gift. Um, <laughs> When he, this is kind of the size of a mug he would want a drink out of. And, and when he goes to eat, he actually, he takes my smallest serving, or my ser smallest mixing bowls, excuse me. And that's what he serves himself in. Oh, I want to show you what's in there so badly, because I was so pleased to find it. But I'm not gonna, because it won't work. It won't work. All right, here... We have sheets, sheets, the top sheet has a ruffle, 
and everything, um, vintage, you can't see very well, the background's like a real pale pink, with a white design, and then there's the roses over that, and these are from Miss Seraphine's bed, because she's going to need some extra sheets, her regular sheets are wearing out, um, so... That's all that is. I'm very pretty. Very pleased with that. She's very pleased with that as well. She's already seen that. <sighs> I don't know what to say about this. I had another day of being that crazy lady sitting on the floor at the frame sorting through every single one of them. There may have been growling at people as they pass by. I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I can't I can't say. I can't say one way or another. <laughs> um I have no use for this that I can think of. It's not really my style. It's not really the style of any room in the house. Um I can't imagine what I'm going to do with it. And I could not convince myself to put it back. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I don't know why. I have no idea why. Um, but yeah, it came home. It's even like, even um, I can look at it and be like, oh yeah, it's kind of even, I don't know. I don't know, but $2 and I just... <sighs> Maybe I'll figure something out. Maybe. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Much more practical, this one. Um, this is country curtains. Um, it's just a curtain. And it's just a single curtain. And the reason I brought it home is that there's a closet in the girls' room that I bought another another thrifted curtain for to use like as a door. Um, but it's not long enough, so I was going to add some length with like a little ruffle at the end or something along those lines. And um, this is kind of a perfect color combination for that, so... I will likely do that. Um, looking at this, and sort of wondering if it's long enough. Maybe it's long enough, and maybe this is the curtain, and maybe I use that curtain for something else. I don't know. And I might also do something with the leftover. If I use it just as the ruffle, I might do something with the leftover fabric on the windows, too, to kind of tie it together. I don't know, but I will be doing something with it. It was, it's, it's just the right color. Um, and I will be doing something with it. This, I think this is the last of it. Um, I have candles, fake candles, on my dresser, which I love. They're, um... Real wax on the outside, but LED candles, and they flicker, and they can be set on a timer, and every night, which we set it on a timer, um, so that for two hours or so there's candlelight in our bedroom. Um, I've been wanting something, right now they're just sitting on the dresser, I've been wanting something for them to rest on, and... Um, give it a little more authenticity, shall we say, because no one would put real candles directly on a dresser, because that would not, that would not make good sense now, would it? <laughs> um, and just to corral them as well, I've found several things over time that I really loved. They were always insanely expensive, like hand-painted trays, things of that nature. Um, I've actually seen this platter couple of times at the Goodwill, it was still sitting there, and I thought I'd give it a try, see see how it felt. I could always get something else. It was only a few bucks, so if 
I don't like the way it looks, I can switch it out sometime, sometime sooner than later. Anyhow, that is the haul from today, plus the extra bits and bobs for the project that you will one day hear about, but will not hear about right this second. And with that, Meadow and I are going to